the Cosmos 3M Russian Cosmos minus 3M meaning Cosmos. Grau Index 11K65M is a Russian space launch vehicle, member of the Cosmos rocket family. It is a liquid-fueled two-stage rocket, first launched in 1967 and with over 420 successful launches to its name. The Cosmos 3M uses UDMH fuel and a K27I oxidizer red fuming nitric acid to lift roughly 1,400 kg 3, of payload into orbit. It differed from the earlier Cosmos 3 in its finer control of the second stage burn, allowing operators to tune the thrust and even channel it through nozzles that helped orient the rocket for the launching of multiple satellites at one time. PO Polio has manufactured these launch vehicles in the Russian town of Omsk for decades. It was originally scheduled to be retired from service in 2011, however, in April 2010 the commander of the Russian Space Forces confirmed that it would be retired by the end of 2010. One further launch, with Canopus Street, was planned, however, this was cancelled in late 2012 as the rocket had exceeded its design life while in storage ahead of the launch. Launches First launched in 1967, with over 424 successful launches to date 2010. Topic. Accidents A total of 446 Cosmos 3 megaseconds were launched from 1967 to 2010, with 22 failures. Some of the more noteworthy ones On the 22nd of December 1970, a launch of a target vehicle for ASAT tests lost thrust at liftoff and fell back onto the pad at Plesisk, exploding and badly damaging it. On 26 June 1973, a Cosmos 3M exploded on the pad at Plesisk during a propellant loading accident, killing nine people. An attempted launch of an Intercosmos scientific satellite on 3 June 1975 failed 84 seconds into the launch when the first stage engine shut down. An attempted launch of a military radar calibration satellite on 25 January 1983 suffered another first stage failure about 40 seconds into launch when the Rode 219 started losing thrust. The onboard computer automatically shut the engine off and the rocket fell into the northern Dvina River. Due to the tense relations between the U.S. and Soviet Union at this time, the U.S. military was widely suspected of having shot down the launch vehicle and General Secretary Yuri Andropov personally informed of this possibility. However, a group of locals ice fishing in the Dvina had witnessed the booster plunge into the river and reported what they'd seen to authorities. After this and a quick examination of telemetry, sabotage was ruled out. The failure was traced to high-frequency combustion instability which had been a problem with the Rode 219 engine and was also responsible for the 1970 and 1975 Cosmos 3M failures. The engine was redesigned and no further launches were lost due to first stage engine failures. More recently, on the 21st of November 2000, a Cosmos 3M launcher failed to place the QuickBird 1 satellite into orbit due to a failure of its second stage. The rocket and satellite re-entered the atmosphere over Uruguay, and an inquest into the accident was inconclusive. See also Comparison of orbital launches families Comparison of orbital launch systems